and welcome back to my channel. This video, I know this palette is old or whatever, but I don't care, it's new to me and I wanna review it for ya. So anyway, <laughs> why keep on doing this now? Anyway, in today's video, I'm going to do the review on the Norvina palette, volume three. <laughs> Yay! All right, I'm so excited about this. I've been wanting to do this palette for a long time. And yeah, let's just see. I got this uh, for my birthday, which was yesterday. Well, by this recording, it's gonna be two days ago. So yeah, anyway, so it was still new. I'm 20 years old now, and let's see what it goes. So let's see, if you guys wanna see how, what look I do with this look, keep on watching. Let's watch some colors for ya. This is volume three. I got volume one for Christmas. This is what volume one looks like. It's like um more of a purple color scheme. Yeah, this is what purple looks like. It's like more purple. Obviously, there's gonna be more orangey tones, like more bright neon colors, which y'all know I live for a good bright color moment. Yeah, this is what the orange one looks like. It's really pretty. I'm so excited. I don't really like the volume two one. I'm gonna put a picture up here, but it's like more blue and stuff. And bitches, that's okay. I'm gonna get the blue blood palette from Jeffree Star. The fuck? Anyway, so. The things I don't like about this palette, it does stink. Like, it smells like glue. Like, real chemically glue. Like. Ew. Sinks. Anyway, so I'm going to swatch some colors. You guys are new to my channel. I love to just swatch a couple colors for y'all that I like. That I think is really pretty. Sorry, I'm selfish. Anyway, so I'm going to swatch this bright neon orange color. I hope they're like really consistent because the volume one is really pigmented. This is what the orange one looks like. Oh, she got pigment. That's good. Thank you. I'm going to swatch this green color right here, which is called D3. Oh, it's so creamy. The orange one was really creamy too. Oh, wow. Uh, yes. It's like a stop sign green. I'm, what? A traffic light green. I'm tired, by the way. If you guys are new to this channel, I like to do my videos late because it's quiet in my house. Nobody's yelling. Nobody's cursing each other out. All right? And let's watch one more. Let's watch a shimmer for you guys. I'm gonna swatch D5. Oh, wait, honey. Hi. Hi. I can't hurt. Ooh, it's like a goldish peach orange shimmer. It's really cute, honestly, I ain't gonna lie. Honestly, I primed with the Anastasia primer and now I'm gonna take the shade, um, so B3 right here, this bright coral color and use it as my transition color. C2 right here and put it in my transition shade as well just so it could be more defined. Deep and stuff up. We're going deep, deep, deep stuff up tonight. So we're gonna take the shade B4 right here and put it in my outer V just to add more definition. off camera because y'all saw this a plenty of times and we did that we're gonna um do a pop of color because bitch i'm sick of this shit okay i'm gonna do this a5 color this is bright orange i'm gonna do that where i put my crease 
because I need a pop of color, you know? Pop color like you pop. So. That, we're gonna take an even darker purple so we're gonna take C4 and mix it with B4 just so it be no harsh lines because it looks really harsh right now and I do not like it Take one of these small like skinny bullet brushes and just go in with that b4 color on the outer like where i put the cut crease so it could be more defined and y'all can see more color because it looks kind of bald in this area girl no we ain't having no baldies okay For inner corner highlight, I'm gonna take the shade C1 right here and put it in my inner corner. Now I'm gonna do my eyeliner off camera and I'll be right back with the final look. Hi guys, so this is the final look. I'm not putting on any my lashes because I already got mascara on and I'll just, yeah, this is the final look. So my final thoughts on the ABH Norvina Collection Volume 3, I fucking love it. Look how tropical it looks. Like, this is like the tropical sunset palette of the bunch. Like, I fucking love this palette. The only thing I don't like about it, to be honest, it, it is like a lot of powdery kick up. Like when you do, let me see, for example, this color. Um, no, that's a bad example. Uh, let's do this color. If you do that, you see all that powder that like flew away? That's the only thing, to be honest. But other than that, I love it. Like, it's so, that means it's packed with pigment. If it's like that, that means it's pigmented the house down. Like, I fucking love this palette. Oh my God. This is like, uh, so like neon colors galore. Like you see that neon yellow, neon green, neon orange, neon green, purple. All that shit, you know? This compared to the purple, I love the purple one too if I'm doing like a purple look or something, but this is everything. Like the shimmers are I, like they're not the best shimmers on the market, but other than that bitch, it's worth it. Like honestly, you got a lot of colors. These palettes are pigmented. Like the purple one is pigmented. All the purples are pigmented because like normally, you know, it's really hard to find a good purple. Normally purples are really patchy. The purple in the volume one palette is not patchy at all. And the purple in this one, I ain't gonna lie, it is kind of hard to blend. Like in the outer corner, it was like low key, low key, low key patchy. Like low key patchy. A tiny bit patchy compared to the one in volume one. The volume one one is really good. This one's good too, but it's not like. <laughs> You know, the purple compared to that one, I like the purple on the volume one one better. Because, obviously, maybe because there's like more purples, but hey, I love this palette too. So, hey. I mean, if it depends on what your vibe is. If you like more purple eyeshadows, go with the purple volume one. If you like more neons, brights, and pops of color, go with volume two. I mean, volume three. And bitch, if you like blue blood, I mean, if you like blue palettes, get the volume two or get Jeffree Star Blue Blood. It's up to you, mamas. All right, make the rules. I'm just, I'm just a messenger. Don't shoot the messenger. Anyway, guys, and also, I like to say that we're two subscribers away from 200 subscribers. If we go to 200, I'm gonna do something real special for ya. So, yeah, guys. I wanna do another get ready with me because I need to have a lot of things that come on my chest. 
2020 really changed me. Bitch, I am coming for blood. I ain't gonna be nobody's fucking baby doll. I ain't gonna be nobody's doll. No fucking blow up doll, no nothing. Ain't no freaking cookies giving that away today. This ain't no fucking insomnia's cookies, honey. I ain't giving away cookies. So anyway, we need to do a get ready with me. Thumbs up or comment down below if you want to see a get ready with me about me talking about my shits. Okay? So yeah, guys. I hope you guys enjoy this quick palette review. I hope you guys love this video. And if you do, you already know how to Give me a big old that. Okay, guys. I love you guys so much. And yeah, I love you, my little babies. 